All right, my friends, Kosho here at the Lion's Den located in Colmar, PA. We're continuing with some strongman videos, everything you guys want for strongman we're throwing at you. And one of the video topics that you guys had asked for was conditioning ideas as a strongman athlete, right? So like, what do we do for conditioning? What are the, the pathways we should be using? Uh, so for me, when it comes to strongman, I like to keep things short and intense, okay? Obviously, we wanna have some sort of base, which is why I recommend you guys maybe jogging once a week, going for some walks, like getting outside to develop an aerobic base, uh, and also just higher volume training is gonna do that for you as well. But when it comes to specific conditioning, I like short and intense, because when you think about it, you're basically gonna be competing for less than five minutes. What? Yeah, did you ever think about that? Because when I first thought about it, I was like, man, I'm here for like eight hours and I only compete for five minutes? Yeah, because most events are 60 seconds. Maybe, maybe you'll get a minute and a half at most, but 60 seconds is usually time cap for most competitions. So what we have set up here today is we're gonna do every minute on the minute, which allows us to work really hard. And then if we work really hard, we get rewarded with good rest. And usually in that rest period, it's allowing us to let our heart rate come down. So we have four stations that we have set up for this. And we have either uh, reps set up or a, t a total distance we have to accomplish with each of these movements. Uh, and then we have the rest period before we move on to the next one. So it's gonna be a total of 20 minutes, uh, but we're probably working, I wanna say in that like, I don't know, five to 10 minute range of actual total output. So we're getting a good chunk of rest uh, if we work really hard. So let's get right to it. Okay guys, so on the first minute, we're gonna be doing uh, a Viper press with a log. Now, if you don't have a log, you can do any sort of clean and press, okay? This is easy to adapt. But for me, I wanna work a uh, log clean and press, specifically doing a Viper press, which is a one motion clean and press. Reason we're doing that is skill acquisition, okay? We're working our conditioning uh, and we're just moving as fast as possible. And I like doing Viper presses when I wanna move fast in a competition. So. For me, I'm just gonna do five reps, okay? Five reps hopefully be done within that 10 to maybe 12 second window, and that gives me a good amount of time to rest, get to my next station. Okay, next one, since we just did more of a specific strongman movement, I'm gonna change it up, and we're just gonna do sledgehammers. One, because who doesn't feel like a badass when I do sledgehammers? That's right, if you don't feel like a badass when you watch sledgehammers, please leave the channel and unsubscribe. Thank you. But. Reason we're doing it guys, it's gonna be a, a low impact or not so much of a very fatiguing movement. It's gonna allow us to get our heart rate up. Um, so we're still working the proper components of the conditioning without taxing our body as much. And for this, we're gonna do eight swings per arm on the minute. All right, my friends, third exercise. We're gonna do a keg carry. Now keg carry for me specifically, because I actually have a keg in an upcoming competition. So I wanna get more reps in with this keg. Now, it could be any carry, okay? You guys could do an overhead carry, you could do a sandbag carry, you could do a zercher carry, although they suck and I don't recommend them, but any carry, right, we're gonna try to cover at least 50 feet. For here, we're basically about 100 feet in here, um, but I want you guys minimally doing 50 feet with the carry, uh, so it's gonna have to be a little bit lighter and you're gonna be moving as fast as possible. Like I said, we wanna be done in that 12 second or less time frame, so we have an equal amount or not equal, we have a, a, a enough of rest time uh, to get to our next exercise. All right, last on this every minute on the minute, we have a sled, okay? A couple reasons for the sled. Uh, one is because it could be specific to strongman, whether you have a sled drag or a sled push or maybe an arm over arm pull, right? We're working those same muscles and that same stimulus as we would in an event, so I love doing this. Uh, secondly, there's no eccentric on the sled, so you're basically uh, being able to get a lot of work in and not necessarily fatigue yourself too much, okay? So you're gonna get a high work output on this. We're gonna blast those lungs, but we're still gonna be able to recover properly and have our uh, executive training sessions uh, after we're done with this conditioning, if that's what we had to do. So those are the two reasons that I really like using the sled. And it's also versatile, like you can use it basically wherever, whenever. Uh, we're just a huge fan of sleds in here. So I'm gonna push this down and back equivalent to 100 feet. 
All right, there we go guys. So hopefully you enjoyed kind of the breakdown of some straw man conditioning that we do. Now that was just four exercises. You can rotate any exercise, use this model. We use it a ton, uh, but basically we're just trying to hit something really hard and then let our heart rate come down. So it's just, you know, blasting back and forth uh, and getting after it. So check it out, try it out, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Head over to ZashRank.net if you guys want to program. We have all sorts of good stuff on there, and we just really appreciate your support. So until then, stay a lean, mean, strength machine. Catch you guys next time. Peace. We haven't done a lean, mean, strength machine shirt. That's what we should do. Oh, yeah, you should. I really say that at the end of every video. Are you, are you filming this? We're still going. Ah, uh, well, spoiler alert. We are going to put out a lean, mean, strength machine shirt, because why not? <laughs>